Why, hello there. Just want to make sure my mic was working. We're going to play a new game I bought. Downside is that. Uh, here it is. Phoenix Points, year one. Year one edition. Uh, it's the first time me starting up the game, so I have no idea if it's going to work or not. Oh, processing. I'm assuming that's the game. Oh, yep. In what may be the hottest year in history, scientists have recorded radical changes to the permafrost in Antarctica. The Pandora virus, a so-called giant virus with the largest genome size ever recorded. The crabs also display increased aggression, even towards larger predators. A striking new weather anomaly has claimed many coastlines around the world. NASA is examining these clouds to figure out... We've detected large amounts of an organic composite. So far, the sample doesn't match any of the DNA records we've compared it with. We all saw it! Those creatures coming out of the sea on that oil rig! The President has declared a national emergency... It's obvious that what we're dealing with here is a biological weapon. As of today, we are at war. It's taking their minds! I saw them walk right into the sea! Thousands of people! Thousands! The mist is gone, but the city is dead. The roads are broken. You must join one of the havens. Do not attempt to survive on your own. Okay. So I'm pretending to read this. Mm-hmm. Okay, and it's basically saying, hey, we have the right to share your data if we're forced, if we're forced to, or we might sell it to um, people because why not? Uh-huh. Sure, why not? Uh, no, I will not buy that. Patch notes, a new game. I'm not buying any of this. I, now, I heard this DLC was actually good. These DLCs are more questionable. I would say this one got mixed reception. This one is outright hated because, like, apparently these both are just artificial spikes to difficulty in the game. It's just not worth it. So, we're not even going to bother with these. At most, I might buy this. But these two, probably not. Unless I just get so used to the game, I, I don't need it. I, I will. I'm more than willing to play on a harder difficulty. Uh, let's see. Veterans. Sandford. Okay, I'm familiar with strategy games. We're not playing on rookie. Uh, Hero is interesting. I haven't played this game yet. Maybe on another run. I will. Legends is never going to happen. I need the prologue in this tutorial. So let's get started. Yes, I have played XCOM and XCOM 2. I've beaten both. I beat XCOM uh, Enemy Unknown? Is that what it is? I've beaten that one multiple times. And I think um, my first time playing... Sitrep is yellow alert. Other refugees are coming from the coast. 400 yesterday. The I mist is coming fast. Cutscene. We need weapons, vehicles, and food. If there's anyone that can respond. Eight, three, seven, we two, listened to nine, the number stations five, every day. Yeah. I took turns with Jacob, waiting for our signal. And finally, it came. A scarab got it too. It's AI directing it to our rendezvous point. We had no news from Symes for many months. Did he send the activation codes? I was desperate to know what happened to him. The mutants were on the march again. Something was happening. 
If the mist was back, then it meant that the Pandora virus was mutating again, twisting the human form into new horrors. We needed to regroup, rebuild. But first, we had to get to that scarab. Okay, I was basically just saying I've played XCOM and X, um, XCOM 2. I've been XCOM 2 once, and I've been uh, XCOM 1, I want to say, two to three times. And I have played the Bureau, which uh, has nothing to do with real strategy, it's just a shooter. I liked it well enough. I won't, yeah. I'm not doing any of this. I'm not going to do that. We're just going to... Yeah, can it work? Does it? No? Yes, it does work. Okay. Okay. This is the rendezvous point. The scarab is waiting for us right over there. So, like, get over here? Why can't I put them in Overwatch? It's forcing me to do this. There. Okay. Are you gonna kill them? No. He hit her and ran. I think it's a woman. Yeah, it's a woman. Can I just click? Oh, no. Uh, sure, it's aim for the head. This must be the scarab. It's seen better days, but it will have to do. Jump inside. Alright, um... Taking position. Move her up. Be right there. Uh, let's see. Ready to engage. How about the other two? Oh, damn it. Oh, good job. Standing over there. I mean, you can't shoot it. I'm on the move. Are you sick? Bruh, come on. Uh, can I'm ready. You, can you move at all? But you can move. 
I can't shoot, so I don't know. We'll, we'll stay back here. And she's gonna get hit again. Well, twice. And that guy's definitely gonna kill her then. Oh, she didn't die. I'll be right there. There's no Overwatch. Ready. Did she move? No. I'm on the move. I just hit my mic thing. I don't know if the mic went out. I just hit my mic thing. I don't know if the mic went out. Okay, it didn't go out. <laughs> All right, sorry about that. Uh, I'll try to be more careful. Uh, we'll just put a way out here. Here I am. Let's do this. too hard I uh, don't there could be just um, just have to learn it maybe we'll see yeah definitely worth 14 bucks so far after several hours traveling the howling noises stopped and then so did the scare up I did a quick survey around our position while Jacob talked to the AI there was an abandoned government reclamation station nearby. These places are usually good for scavenging supplies and equipment, but they often attracted desperate gangs. The AI gave us the reason for our stop. An emergency rescue signal from another Phoenix operative. We had a location too, right in the middle of that station. The Scarab made it clear that we should attempt a rescue before continuing with our journey. Despite no sign of the mutants, our comrade was clearly under threat. The Scarab's missile launcher would prove very useful. We've got visual on the building. The Phoenix operatives should be close by. There are hostiles up ahead, so stay vigilant. Overwatch. Area covered.
Come get some. Here I am. Let's do this. Peace. Let's go. I'm on the move. Sprinting. They can't stop me! Let's go! Thank <laughs> you. 
Ready, willing, and able. Moving in quick. Ready to rumble. Heading out. Here we go. I'm prepared. Ready to engage. I'm on Overwatch.
Let's go. Is it? Glad you found some gear, cause you're gonna need it. Now you're part of my squad. After the battle, the Scarab resumed its course towards our base, struggling through the rough terrain. Strange growths were contorting the road, smashing against its armor. It wasn't long before it took one too many hits. The engine gave a loud crack and the AI went dark. We had lost a valuable member of the team. We knew we were close to our destination, but we didn't know what we would find there. If we were to advance on foot, we had to exercise extreme caution. Approaching the base, we heard gunshots. Jacob and Omar took positions by my side. What was going on inside? A bandit ambush or something much worse? Following Phoenix protocol, we readied our weapons. It is time to reclaim our home. Tread lightly. There are hostiles up ahead. Let's get rid of them and clean up this mess. There's nothing important over here. Uh, since he's a big dude, should I just move him up forward? Going in. No visual, but I can hear commotion coming from the hangar. We must investigate.
I should send everyone else this way. That's a turn. There we go. I did out the mouse. I messed up. Let's go. Okay, I need to waste action points to pick all that up. We've got a poison worm situation. Somebody get a med kit. Here I am. Let's do this. Receiving loud and clear. Uh. I'm prepared. Steady, take overwatch positions and wait for them to come. Oh, I sure can save my game. I didn't even think about that. Save, new, just call the stream run. Stop me! Put you right there. A new person just gonna have you just run on ahead. I thought it was not dead. Moving in quick. Something there's a pathway that way, so I might take it. Confirm. There. 
I'm on the move. Reporting enemy contact. Rolling out. Target located. Can you shoot either? Thanks. Be careful not to hit her. I'll keep both eyes open. You both, oh, of course, here it comes, here it comes. Okay, now we're gonna have someone shoot that off our head. Hip hip hooray. Oh, joy is day, now both of them. We gotta do both of them, hooray. Just because both of them miss their shots. Okay, we got these two back here. They, they, they might be able to do something. They might. She has another shot. Please have another shot. Plan. Uh, we're gonna have you shoot her. One less to worry about. Moving now. Sprinting. The door is shut, so we'll have to use those ladders. Go, go, go! There's a monster up there, though. Move 
Moving in quick. I'll we'll just get everyone close to the ladder. Out the way his shots if it comes to, if that thing jump, jumps down or something. Which I doubt. Just kinda want everyone to be at least close to each other. I did give her a bunch of grenades. Comes online. Also, I find this interesting, having to, being able to pick up items like this. Alright. If it walks back here, that'd be actually better. I'm on the move. Come on, I'll get you. No. I guess him dead down there. And there's someone down here. Well, I guess we'll see in a Rolling second. Out. Somebody bashed that thing off his face. Shoot. 
I'm on the move. Uh oh. Here I am. Let's do this. Reporting enemy contact. Let's do this. Moving now. Actually, you move right here. Oh, like juggernauts. No, she can't. Channel open. Mm. Shot went mm. wide. Caution. I'm on the move. Positioning. Zooming in. Mm. Sure. Hostile mist. However, you miss every shot. Moving. Ready to engage. Finger on the trigger. Hostile destroyed. Eyes peeled. Kills confirmed. Phoenix? Welcome home. The reclamation of Phoenix Point was just the first step on our path ahead. A desperate fight against an overwhelming foe, and only a handful of friends to help. But if this base could withstand the attack, then so could we, and so could Symes. If our leader was somewhere out there, we had to re-establish contact. 
no matter the cost. So is that it? Maybe? The Phoenix Project was founded on October 24th, 1945. The second war to end all wars was over, but there were those who understood that we could no longer afford to think in terms of nations and empires. For a time, the Phoenix Project successfully navigated the political conflicts of its era. That was our golden age. Phoenix Project operatives scoured the world for clues. We had bases in two dozen countries, even the heavens were not off limits. But out there, on the far side of the moon, began our downfall. The failure of the Phoenix 2 mission exposed us to our enemies in the UN. Stripped of resources and scattered to the winds, we were reduced to a secret, a memory. When the Pandora virus woke up, we should have been the first line of defense. When huge clouds of mist appeared over the sea, when people started vanishing, we should have figured out what was going on. And when those people started coming back, changed, hostile, alien, we should have been ready to fight, but we failed. The ecosystem started to change, imperceptibly at first, then faster and faster. Three factions arose, New Jericho, trying to restore order and purity. Sinedrin, hoping to build a world without hierarchies. And the Disciples of Anu, a new syncretic religion dedicated to adaptation and biological change. At war with the world and at odds with each other, these factions cannot find a way forward. Now the mist is returning and armies are rising from the sea. Without the Phoenix Project, humanity will fall. It's time to rise from the ashes. Okay, I get it. Oh boy. I don't think time's a move forward when you're just sitting here, is it? Nope. Got one base. Fall of into pieces. Okay, I'll be done in three hours. Here it is.
Okay, before you send out squads to spoil, you should equip your soldiers. This is the first thing. Okay. Okay, okay. Have to choose that though. I kind of auto equipped everyone.
Those crates contain valuable material, so grab everything you can. This place will be crawling with mutants any minute now. Cause I've just been doing side missions. Uh, Cause I've been wanting to level up my party. So not too far off. I'm basically where Mordred is looking for what happened to King Arthur. So overall, not too much story has happened. I'm mostly just, as I just said, mostly doing side content. Uh, getting new knights to my round table. And we're just gonna end stream. Until next time.